Good morning. I'm just getting ready for the day to go out with Ava. I'm on like day three of not washing my hair. I try to go a week between hair washes, otherwise it really dries out my hair. So obviously I shower in between, but I don't wash my hair. And this is the dry shampoo that I use. It's the Dove one. I like it, but it's also been a while since I've got my hair done. I got a balayage done in May before we went on vacation, and I haven't had it done since, and now it's like October. So my hair, you can see where the like blonde starts is like here. So it's significantly grown out, and I have a little bit of gray hair, but I just haven't had the time to go. And like it takes like five hours in a salon and I just don't have that kind of time to take out of the day. I'm just sort of rocking the long roots and <laughs> grey hair right now. But it is what it is. Ren and I are going to go to Home Depot this morning. I've got a few home bits that I need to buy for the bathroom because we are renovating our bathroom. It's going really well. There'll be a video on that soon. A few bits I need to buy. I need to buy some grass seed and some more rocks for, hey baby, Hi. for the front um, garden beds, and just a few other things we need to buy. So, just getting ready for the day, but I'm gonna mix. This is like my tinted moisturizer, it's by L'Oreal, and I add in a little, bit of, a little bit of these Anastasia Beverly Hills Liquid Glow, but it's in a shade that's way too dark for me. But it, <laughs> It actually is really useful because I can use it to darken my tinted moisturizers really well. And still adding like a really nice glow. So I literally add like the smallest drop to my tinted yes. moisturizer. That's better. Oh, and if anyone's wondering what fake tan I use, it's the Loving Tan 2 Hour Express in Dark. I always put a little bit of this um, Laniage, Laniage, I have no idea, Laniage, the lip sleeping mask, it's so nice, I put it on at night but I also put it on throughout the day. We are ready to go to Home Depot, <laughs> to buy some stuff, yeah, you want to go out with mommy? We're tired of being stuck in the house, huh? Oh, Ava also got her first black eye, I don't know if you can see, but she ran into our dining room table, okay. Slowly. Yeah, she ran into our dining room table pretty fast and she hit her her cheek right here and the next morning she woke up and the bruise had just like gone into her eye. So it's not too bad, but you got your first little black eye, huh? <laughs> I see you. I see you, baby. Open the garage. We just got back from Home Depot, managed to get everything that I needed, which was great. And then on the way home, um, we stopped by the local playground. We'd never been there before, but I'd always wanted to check it out to see if it was good for her, you know, clean, <laughs> busy, anything like that. So I stopped by and there was only um, one other family I there. You, I, see you. I see you. So it was really nice. She had a little climb and a slide and could run around and get some energy out and it's only two minutes from home. So now um, I feel like it's something else that I can take her to do now that's sort of still away from people because I am still paranoid about COVID. Okay, mommy's doing it. Mommy's doing it. Look. In other news though, we have decided that we want to start trying for baby number two. Um, we feel that Ava is at a really good age right now. She is just shy of two months past the age of two, so she's two. But um, when the baby is born, she'll be almost three and I think that is a good age gap because by then she'll be talking more, she'll be you know, able to communicate with me while I have a newborn. And I think that will be easier than um, um, having a non-verbal toddler with a newborn. Um, but um, it's also a good age difference. We don't want to wait really any much longer than um, 
we feel like they won't really grow up together they'll be quite separated they'll be close to four years so we think three years is great and i do feel ready to be pregnant again i think um it was hard the first time but this time um yeah we, we will see you know um I don't know if this pregnancy will be as hard. It might be completely different. It might be super easy. Um, I hope so. <laughs> we will see. Um, but yes, um, we're actually going to start trying next cycle, which is really, really exciting. So you will have lots of trying to conceive um, and pregnancy videos coming up. If I get pregnant, I will take you through the whole journey with me. Um, from you know trying to get pregnant what I'm doing um, the products that I'm using all of that good stuff um, I'm really excited I think we're we're ready and this will probably be our last baby so my last pregnancy <laughs> when I when I was pregnant last time I'm like I don't want to be pregnant anymore so when I'm pregnant I'll probably be like yep this is good that this is my last one but I know that I'll also be sad that it's my last time ever going to be pregnant we think we might have a third, but probably not. Um, two is two is good. I think that way we're not outnumbered. <laughs> but um, yeah, so I do get sad thinking about that this will be like the last time doing the pregnancy, the newborn thing, all that stuff. Um, so I'm gonna try and enjoy it as much as I can, even when I feel really bad when I'm pregnant. I'm gonna try to really enjoy it since it will probably be my last time. But yes, I will take you through everything with me, all of the steps, trying to conceive, um, pregnancy tests, ovulation tests, good products, bad products, we're gonna do it all. That's and, me. <laughs> okay, and I'm, I'm really excited. So I hope you guys will follow me along this journey on our trying to conceive um, baby number two. Do you want mommy and daddy to have another baby? Mommy. Yeah? Mommy. Mommy, you want mommy and daddy to have another baby? Maybe. Do you want to be a big sister? sister. You want to be a big sister? Yeah? Hey. Yeah, you want a baby? <laughs> Like the day before You're like a stone on my pillow I don't make a sound when I shut the door Favorite. 